Hello guys, this is Shubhadi. Welcome to my channel. So in this tutorial, we are going to see a comparison. So what we are going to compare? We are going to compare between first seven months revenue and last seven months revenue. Okay. So how can we do in DAX? Let's see. So in the first seven months revenue. I have written a text com a text command like that. First of all, it will calculate total profit. So first of all, it will calculate total profit. Then I put dates in period. So what dates in period does? Uh, we can see in Microsoft's um, here this uh, they told that dates in period returns a table that contains a column of dates that begins with a special start date and continues for the specified number and type of the date intervals so what is doing uh, first of all it is calculating total profit then it is filtering that profit with uh, dates in period i put dates in period and what is the date date you can see it is orders orders date okay here you can see the order date in this data set so then we are going to do the minimum so why it is uh, i have i have put minimum because it is first seven months revenue so here you can see the it is uh, 2011 12 13 and 14 data set so what is the minimum here minimum it is 2011 okay and here first seven months so what will be the first seven months quarter one quarter two quarter one quarter two combining say, uh, six months and quarter three it will take only july okay these seven months revenue i want to see so in first seven months revenue first it will calculate it calculate the total profit then it will filter with dates in period and we put the what is the date columns here then minimum so you can understand why we put minimum then what will be the minimum order date we put orders order date and how much month we want we want seven months data and month okay if we run this we get first seven months revenue and we want also last seven months revenue <coughs> so how we can get it again same calculate and we are filtering total profit with dates in period okay it will it is taking uh, what we put the uh, the uh, range okay dates in period takes a range what we want okay so it is taking orders order date and the range will be last date because it is last seven months revenue so we take a function called last date so last date of order date okay and it is will be and it will be minus seven because it is coming from behind okay so what will be the uh, why minus 7 because it is taking 2014 data it was minimum okay 2011 was minimum and 2014 is maximum so it will take last seven months that means quarter 4 october november december quarter 3 july august september and quarter 2 june okay so it will take these seven months data okay so calculate we are calculating total profit then filtering with dates in period and what will be the range the range will be last date of order date minus seven month okay so we are taking a hundred percent stack bar chart and here we can see and we are <coughs> We are filtering it with all the markets okay africa apsc canada you can see 
so here <clears throat> if we go there and hover on it it will taking first seven months revenue in africa 9.85 percent and the last seven months revenue is 90.15 percent okay like this it will come APAC 24 percent first seven months revenue and 75 percent is last seven months revenue I think you guys got this video if you like my videos please comment subscribe my channel like my video and share with your friends it will help me and encourage me to grow up to date okay thank you